Brookshire lost the handle. Johnson to Allen. Showtime! It's a Kansas City party in Como. Frank couldn't handle it. McKay the other way in the open floor. McKay for the lead. The racers are on top. Blackwell back outside. Frank wants it for the lead. Man, they needed that one. Williams against Young. Spins to the double. Dembele for three. She's doing it all! A Show Me State Showdown atop at Mizzou Arena. The Kansas City Roos continue their Power 5 gauntlet with a trip to Columbia to battle the homestanding Missouri Tigers. 1-0 after a win over Central Michigan Tuesday night. With that, we say hello courtside. He's the former Tiger, Kevin Furrier. I'm Nate Gatter. So glad to have you with us. For Missouri, Kevin, no doubt this is an inexperienced team. Only three returners, just one senior, but that's Javon Pickett, and he turned out to be enough to get the win against Central Michigan. Absolutely. Fantastic outing by Javon Pickett, the first game uh, against Central Michigan. 18 points, uh, three steals. Led team in both of those categories. Absolutely at his best when he is getting downhill. As you see it right here, nice lay, uh, layup on the baseline. Um, also has improved his shot. You know, I had a chance to visit practice a couple weeks ago and uh, Javon is shooting the ball at a much higher clip this year also. Pickett has been a hard worker throughout his four years, Kanto Martin said, and getting that reward now with those 18 on opening night. Meanwhile, for Kansas City, Josiah Alec had 21 at Minnesota. Not a surprise for the preseason first team all Summit League selection, but just four against Iowa. KP, it's really about keeping him on the floor. Absolutely. In our conversation with Coach Dowlin earlier, uh, made an emphasis that, you know, we need to keep Josiah on the floor. Um, so I would definitely, um, you know, keep an eye out for him, just trying to stay out of foul trouble and not getting any ticky tack fouls early. The fifth all-time meeting between Missouri and Kansas City on tap. The Tigers have won three out of four, but the Ruse won the last matchup, 69-61, in November of 2014, the first game of the Kim Anderson era at Missouri. Kobe Brown will tip for Missouri against Alec for Kansas City. Mizzou in white and Kansas City in navy. The Ruse have the opening tip on the road, and we are underway. Marvin Nesbitt Jr. against Pickett on the block. Couldn't get it, and Boogie Coleman grabs the rebound. One of a couple of transfers, three of them, in fact, in that starting lineup for Missouri, along with Amari Davis and the debuting Dejuan Gordon, who missed the opener. Kobe Brown and Javon Pickett, the two returners in the lineup for the Tigers. And an offensive foul called right away on Missouri, an early one against Kobe Brown. Meanwhile, for Kansas City, Starting five that uh, has a couple of transfers in it as well. Seems like everybody's lineup does around the country. Evan Gilliard, the point guard from New Mexico State. Anderson Cobb in from Lamar. Yeah, Missouri's really getting after it already. I can tell. Um, they're denying the ball really hard. Amari Davis is trying to turn him in the backcourt. Early bucket for Jacob Johnson. Average only about five a game last year. More important for Kansas City at the defensive end of the floor. But Billy Donlin said sometimes his offense can just even raise his defensive effort level another tick. Pick it against Johnson all the way in. Can't get it and cop the rebound. And that's when he's at his best. I mean, he missed that one with Javon. He's, he's his absolute best when he gets downhill. Johnson to cop. Alec wasn't looking for it. Seven to shoot for Nesbitt. Poked away by Brown. Nesbitt saves it. Three on the timer. Intercepted by Gordon. In transition with Davis. He's won Gordon as his first Missouri bucket. Great finish by Gordon. That really all started with Kobe Brown on the other end. Really doing a great job moving his feet. Cutting off that baseline. Gordon, the six foot three junior from Chicago by way of Kansas State. Had 14 against Kansas City in their matchup last year. Gilliard lost it under pressure from Brown on the hedge and out of bounds. Get another look at that steal and the first two of his Tigers career for Dejuan Gordon. Great finish by Gordon. Gordon under pressure from Gilliard and it's last off of Gordon out of bounds. So Missouri turns it over right back. And Kansas City 
We'll get the basketball in a 2-2 game just a couple of minutes in. The Ruse coming off a 32-point loss against Iowa on Friday night. But a game in which Alec, as we mentioned at the outset, was very limited by foul trouble. He had three in the first half. Post touch against Brown. Spins away from the double and misses. That's the third possession where Kobe Brown has just played extremely solid defense. Pick it inside. Elevates and scores. Great take by Pickett. He loves that right hand drive. Great drive. The Ruse did play Minnesota very tough, though, in their opener up in the Twin Cities. They lost by 15 in the end, but they were within two points with four minutes to go. Pop for three and hits it. Great shot by Cobb. That's what they brought him in to do. Brown faces up on Alec. With a right-hand hook that he scores, Conzo Martin wanted Kobe Brown to be more aggressive looking for his own shot. Oh, and he's very capable. I, I really would love when he catches it around that free-throw line area, if he was just face up and, and evaluate what he has on the floor. Um, he, he has one-on-ones all night, and he can definitely take advantage of those. Good drive and finish through contact by Nesbitt. Gordon back door and lost it inside. Missouri wanted a whistle, didn't get it. Kansas City can come the other way with a basketball and a one-point lead. Hilliard on the attack. Davis the rebound. Missouri can run. Pickett into Johnson and a foul called on the floor before Pickett's layup. And that gives us a chance to meet the third-year head coach of the Ruse, Billy Donlin, formerly the head coach at Wright State from 2010 to 2016, then an assistant at Michigan and Northwestern before Kansas City. Meanwhile, Conzo Martin in his fifth season as Missouri's head coach, and he has a roster that he's still figuring out right now. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. You know, uh, only three guys that returned from last year, a lot of new faces, nine newcomers. Um, so, yeah, definitely some things to sort through, but, uh, you know, by the looks of the Central Michigan game and the, the start today, looks like they're off to a good start. Anton Brookshire is in for Missouri, gets an immediate look from the corner and missed everything. Kansas City comes the other way through Shamari Allen. Top a deep one, and he's hit back-to-back -back three. Great shot. It's a good shot by Cop. They did a great job of pushing the tempo. Kansas City generally doesn't like to play very fast. By adjusted tempo ready from Ken Palm last year, they were one of the 20 slowest teams in the country. And a held ball. Initially, the referee looked like he had called a foul. Instead, it's a held ball. Missouri will keep possession out of the timeout. Anderson Kopp led the team with 11 against Iowa on Friday. He has a couple of early triples to give Kansas City a four-point lead. <laughs> 